Welcome to Crime Fighters, the police and you. Your number one security program on television. Recently, the Inspector General of Police, Sir Mike Mbama Ukiru, introduced an innovation where the monthly Inspector General's Conference for Commissioners of Police and above, usually held as force headquarters, is moved to other conducive locations outside the headquarters. The first was held at the Obudukatu Ranch in Cross River State last month. In our discussion segment today, we bring you the highlights of the main trust of this month's conference for commissioners of police and above held at the Yankari National Park in Bochi State. One whom the gods have blessed, let no one curse. So it has been with Sir Mike Mbama Ukiru as this month's edition of the Inspector General's Conference for Commissioners of Police and Above took place penultimate Wednesday, 18th June 2008 at the Green and Serene Yankari National Park in Bochi State. In line with his philosophy of dynamic and focused leadership, the Inspector General of Police, Sir Mike Mbama Ukiru, has positively altered the perception of Inspector General's Conference where officers now attend without excuses. The retreat tagged Policing for Better Nigeria was declared open by the Executive Governor of Baoshi State, Alhaji Isa Yuguda. In his welcome address, the Inspector General of Police, Sir Mike Mbama Okiru, expressed his gratitude to the Governor and people of Baoshi State for hosting him and his officers. The first thing will be to show appreciation to the good people and government of Bachi State for what they have done for the police. I'm not able to continue, but coming to say thank you very much. We and God of us. If I come alone or the common government, the governor come to Abuja and I go and say thank you. It's only me, but now I can see. All the officers are proud for him, which means I appreciate what he do for the police. The executive governor of Bauchi State, Alhaji Isa Yuguda, in his address before declaring the conference open, thanked the inspector general for choosing the Yankari National Park for the conference, promising that by next year, the Games Reserve will be much improved as he was determined to boost the tourism potentials of Bauchi State. My sincere gratitude to the Inspector General of Police, upon my hero, who has decided Of 
The conference had as its main trust, amongst many other administrative issues, dress code and the duplication of petitions on its agenda. The Inspector General of Police had observed with dismay how officers dress in different fashions without regards to Force Orders 247, which deals with official dressing in the Nigeria Police Force, and the avoidable dissipation of man hour and materials in investigating duplicated petitions at the divisional, area command, and state CID levels across the country. We see our officers under dress in different fashions, different colors of dress, different colors, different bottles, different cap badge, and so forth. We want to harmonize our uniform. And also, the Police Service Commission Chairman mentioned the, the badges and did not wear. I want us to go and organize that. So, uh, for the master, I did hear, I have to come and let us. The force quartermaster came up to analyze the various official dresses as one in the Nigeria Police Force. The Israel General of Police has observed with dismay the way and manner of the officers can address in this period without regard to standard that contains the first order as a true force of this period. In face of the observation of the IEP that transmitted this observation and this presentation, it is clear that after this address, all officers and men to dress in conformity with the general standard. One, and full dress, the more full dress for the so of men, can dress, pick up the police partners. AIG Mokhtar M. Abbas, who advocated a Nigeria police museum where one will be able to find all types of police uniforms and accoutrements from colonial times till date. Most mobile policemen, this is how they will dress. Normal working dress, ceremonial dress, uh, mounted troop, this is how they would dress, ceremonial dress. And then, lastly, I had wanted to recommend to the Nigeria police what we have seen during our tour from the news in the Jalder and Senegal. They have a marvelous museum. Nigeria police, we are losing records. We don't have the museum where you can go and see the Niger, how the uh, Niger guards dress up, their medals, all these things are, we are losing them. If the Nigeria police will establish the museum, you see there, even you see a statue of a mountain policeman on us, a statue. You see a rider, a dispatch rider, on his motorcycle in different dress. And then you see all their medals, you see their cap badges right from colonial time to the present day. We speak that you go around, if any other museum you see in the world, very, very impressive. If you call on ex policemen and even any police, local government police, we have retired officers, some are dying, their medals are being lost in their houses. If you call some of these old, old policemen will be donating what they have to the museum. The Inspector General of Police, Sir Mike Mbama Okiru, then directed that the quartermaster should prepare properly with PowerPoints and slides to electronically brief officers during next month's conference. Next time, next time, we are advancing. We are advancing, the police advance, we are going to give police. I want to show example of technology in the police. Thereafter, the vexed and thorny issue of duplicated petitions took the front burner. That's the duplication of cases. People in 
Nigerians and the habits of what it is against them, the repetition, they keep them taking over the land command. From division, they head to the same quarter will take it over to other division and the CP special unit or CCIT. So I ask Martin, the same case, is it the creation of the people? In his contributions, the Special Fraud Unit Commissioner of Police, Olain Kabalogu, decried the situation where the suspect in a case in a division, because he has friends, petitions to the area command and becomes a complainant. When the man is about to be taken to court in a division, the case has been the man is about to take him to court and his offices at the uh, area commander's level. And then he printed a different story. And before you know it, the other man is arrested. At times, I you, you, the arguments from some officers can be very funny. When you call him and say, no, that man has a case to answer. He said, no, he's my complainant. He can't be your complainant when he's a suspect here. Present at the conference with Deputy Inspectors General of Police, all AIGs and all commands, commissioners of police across the states.